I'm Mike Ryan. This is my 1971 Datsun 240Z, and her name is Blanca. As a kid growing up, I used to see them around town, you know, back in the 70s when they first came out. So fast forward about nine years later, it's 1997, and I wanted to back a vehicle, and I was looking through the old auto traders, and I came across the Datsuns uh, again, the Datsun section. And I saw a Z in there, and I liked it, and so I went ahead and made an offer and picked up my first Z in 1978. So I came across the Z uh, back in 2013. Um, I was in between Z cars. This was my span of switching Z cars every year. And um, for a while there, I went through a drought, couldn't find one. And lo and behold, through networking, um, through some friends on Facebook and other Z communities, uh, I met a guy that put me in touch with the owner of this car at the time. Um, his name was Tony A to Z Adamowix. He was a race car driver. And um, I called Tony up, and we talked for a long time on the phone, told me some bunch of stories about his racing career, and we met up, and, you know, I made him an offer, and the rest is history. You know, it's funny, when you get behind the wheel of one of these cars, you go through a change, go through a personality change. Um, it's exhilarating. It's, it's fun. goes without saying uh, your whole attitude changes you you get I don't know focused um, you're kind of one with the vehicle when you get in there and you start going you know and you really let it rip uh, one of the things that really excites me about the car is when you rev the accelerator pedal you, you, you mash it and it just whoa, you know it's got a nice growl to it the the sound of the exhaust um, the when the car accelerates it's, it's a feeling like no other, you know, you get behind the wheel of this thing and you just blast down the road and it's just, it's an amazing feeling. It's hard to describe until you get behind the wheel of it. So when I first bought the car, very clean car overall, no issues other than um, it needed some brakes. The brakes were, you know, kind of chattery and um, it always ran real good. And then we went ahead and did a whole overhaul of the suspension. The suspension was worn out. It was kind of old. So the car wasn't really handling as good as it could have. Um, it had just old uh, struts and springs. And just it just felt kind of sloppy. So we went ahead and went with the Techno Toy Tuning suspension and BC coilovers. Uh, wheelwood brakes, front and back, uh, front and rear disc brakes. Uh, we did a lot of things. On the engine in the engine bay, you know, all new uh, like strut bars, uh, polish valve cover. Uh, the the Makuni carburetors are rebuilt. Um, I had a set of triple Webers on there before. Um, I've always wanted a set of triple Makunis, so I had a Taka from Kyusha House uh, rebuild me a set of uh, Makuni 40s, the triples that I have over there, um, and the car hauls butt. It, it, it really gets up and goes. 
So as far as the engine, the engine was built years ago uh, by an old Datsun mechanic. And then Tony actually bought the car from him. S3 Life Hat. Blancanators. Swole Alexander. You know what time it is. Boom! Blanca time.